Hi everyone, in this video I am going to show you how to log in to GoDaddy cPanel and install WordPress. So let's get started. So at first we are going to log in to our GoDaddy account and this will take us to this page. So this is our my products page. So if you are not on this page then you can click on this drop down from the top and then click on my products. Here it will show you all the products that you have purchased from the GoDaddy. But we are going to scroll down to the web hosting section and then click on this drop down. And next to our web hosting we are going to see manage button. So we will click on it. And this will take us to our web hosting dashboard. So now to log into our cPanel account from the top we are going to click on cPanel admin. And this will take us to our cPanel account. So now we are in the cPanel account and from here we are going to see how we can install WordPress. So from the cPanel dashboard we are going to scroll down to applications section. So here it is and from the applications section we are going to click on WordPress. So to install WordPress on our GoDaddy cPanel, from the top we are going to click on install this application. And now from here we can do the WordPress settings and install it. So we are going to scroll down a little bit. So the first one is our location section. And from here we are going to select our domain name on which we are going to install WordPress. If you have one domain name on your web hosting, then it will be automatically selected but if you have multiple domain names then you will have to select it from the drop down. So you can click on this drop down next to the domain section and from here you can easily select it. After the domain name you will see a directory tab. If you want to install WordPress directly on your main domain then you can leave this directory tab blank but if you want to install it on the subfolder then you can use this tab. So as I want to install it on the subfolder then I am going to use this tab and I am going to give it a name. New website. So now WordPress will be installed on my main domain.com slash new website. So next is our version tab. We are going to keep these settings as it is and we will go to the next step. And from here we are going to create a admin account for our WordPress website. So I am going to quickly enter my details and then we will go to the next step. So I have entered my username, password and the email. And our next is website title and website tagline. You can change this from your WordPress website dashboards. So we are going to leave it as it is from here. Now scroll down to limit login attempts. If you want to limit login attempts on your WordPress website, then you can choose this radio box yes. But if you do not want it, then you can choose this one no. Now leave everything as it is and scroll down to the bottom and then click on install. So in this way WordPress will be installed on your GoDaddy cPanel and now if you want to visit your WordPress website then just click on this first link and this will take you to your WordPress website. And if you want to access your WordPress website dashboard then click on this second link and this will take you to your WordPress website dashboard. So this is how you can install WordPress on your GoDaddy cPanel. Thank you so much for watching the video tutorial. Please like the video and subscribe to my channel.